I would say we welcome a role that India or any other country could play in helping achieve a just and lasting peace that recognizes Ukraine's uh, territorial integrity and recognizes Ukraine's sovereignty. Finally, when Prime Minister Narendra Modi was here at the White House, Ukraine issue came up and he has spoken many times that uh, the war should stop. Uh, do you think Narendra Modi or India can still break the ice and play in this role to stop the war? Um, a, a few things. So I will say, uh, with respect to your first question, we believe the war has been a strategic failure for Ukraine. Uh, the Secretary spoke to this in a speech he gave in Helsinki uh, last month, I believe it was. Uh, what's that? So, I'm sorry. A excuse me. A strategic failure for for Ukraine. Uh, thank you for the correction. Um, uh, which is oh, I, I I need more than one cor correction today. A strategic. This is the first time at the podium for for a week. I'm a little. I'm apparently a little rusty. I never expected anyone to consider you know that. I never expected you guys to see the high ground. I'm I'm a, I'm a little rusty. I guess. Uh, a strategic failure. A strategic failure for Russia, um, uh, which has seen um, an enormous loss of uh, both um, military personnel but, personnel, but military equipment that's seen its standing in the world affected, um, that's seen its uh, economy crippled by the sanctions and export controls we've Im imposed. I will say with respect to what other countries of the world can do, we welcome the, the international support that Ukraine has received uh, since the beginning of this conflict. And to your last question, um, I would say we welcome a role that India or any other country could play in helping achieve a just and lasting peace that recognizes Ukraine's uh, territorial integrity and recognizes Ukraine's sovereignty. Mm -hmm.